And I love one of my pieces for when my clients goes into another jeweler's hands and they sit there examining and everything else and all oh, stone fell out. Bitch, a fun stone's always gonna fall out. No matter what the fuck you do if you're jumping around, you know. But I put that VS hallmark on the back of the fucking piece because I really use it. And when you hallmark something, 10K, 14K, 18K, you are legally stamping what that gold is or what the diamonds are. We're the ones who started that VS shit, you know what I mean? I just recently started stamping VVS Plus, but it's a high number, but it's true. 90% of these jewelers that say they're VS, I'll, I'll give them a benefit of the doubt. They're definitely SIs. Some of these other jewelers, they like SI2, SI3, and it's, it's a bad look, man. It makes us look bad. And let me tell you something, man. If you're getting real VS diamond parcel in, in, in your pieces, you know what I'm saying? You're paying a thousand a carat. If you're not paying a thousand a carat, ain't no secret to it, then you're just not doing it. You're getting CVDs, man. Period. And you know, all these jewelers think that uh, we're in the same game, and you know, I'm, it's not anything cocky, nothing, I mean, but we're actually not. We're really not in the same game. You can get all the rappers you want to. I choose to fuck with some rappers here and there. I'm not here to beat your prices, I'm gonna beat your work. Period. For the last time. I am not fake jeweler buster. If you follow my stories or certain things and whatever, and what time he posts, I don't have that kind of time, first of all. But uh, yes, yeah, not me, but he's definitely a jeweler. One million percent, he's a jeweler. Like, why would I go at Jimmy Boy? That's actually a real friend of mine in life. Like, I'm real cool with this dude. Like, me and this motherfucker have been through some shit, did some dirt, been on the streets. That's my peoples. Icebox and my peoples. Like, you know, I got no beef with nobody.